You know, I'd like to say I really enjoy your work. Top notch. Just tip top work. Thank you. Okay, 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 no. Who the fuck told you to chew gum? Huh? What, what am I supposed to do about this now? Well, if someone wouldn't have been late, maybe we could have figured it out hours ago. No, 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 no. no. Oh, Jen will be out any second. She just has a little bit more to do. Hair. Look, I tried to get it out myself. And for your information, the gum was the lowest calorie thing in the basket, okay? Oh, okay, so now all of a sudden you care what that hole in your face ingests. Hmm? Just fix it. You want me to die? Huh? This is what you're doing to me. I can't function like this, Jen. This is too much pressure. My work, my art, the whole world will be seeing this. My career is ruined! Stop freaking out and just focus. Come on, Santa, you have to think of something. I can't go on TV looking like this. It looks like a fucking pink fairy jizzed on my head. Oh, no, not you. Like, if a little fairy was on my head and jizzed... Okay, 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 okay. Okay, let me think. Thank you. I think I got it. Okay. Oh, it's cool. It's just Jen. I think. With me now are Jen Anderson and Mandy Diaz, possibly the two most recognized names in American pop culture at this moment. And it is my privilege to give you the exclusive interview behind their success. Ladies, it's a pleasure to be here with you today. It's nice to be here, Charlie. Thank you for having us. Tell me, what's it like to make history? What's it like to be part of the first lesbian sex tape? It feels, it feels great. It feels really good, Charlie. Now, I assume you had no idea this tape would be leaked, correct? Oh, no. Mm -mm. No! <laughs> who does that? Yeah, really, who does? So, in terms of um, choreography, shall we say, this is the first glimpse that American living rooms have gotten into what real lesbian sex looks like. It really humanizes lesbian sex in a way, wouldn't you say? Humanize? I think humanize is the wrong word. But yes, but I mean, here for the first time, we have two women, females, in the privacy of their own home, in love with each other, in their natural habitat, doing it, essentially. Yes, yes, in love and <laughs> really doing it. Yeah. <laughs> you know, when I watched the video, I couldn't quite tell from the camera angles who's the giver and who's the taker. Who's the what? I mean, who is the dominant member in the relationship and who's the passive one? I really, I really think it's more of a fluid thing, Charlie. Like, it just depends on what side of my head the ponytail's on that morning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have time for one last question before the break. Now, having two private parts of the same kind during intimacy, uh, how do you know which one is yours? <laughs> um, Sorry. That's a really good question, Charlie. Oh, please let me have this one. Okay, Charlie, so basically we play Marco Polo in the bedroom and we just yell out to each other. Sometimes we use bird calls and we find each other. You know, we find together. Every once in a while, we don't sink each other's battleships. You know what I mean? I see. Great. And we'll be back in a moment. That's good. Really enjoyed your ladies' work. Just tip top. Thanks. Thank you, Charlie. Keep on tagging, tagging, baby. I try to give it up, give it up, give it up.